13 car hacks that will save your trip. The average American spends at least 90 minutes a day behind the wheel. That's definitely a lot, so why not spend this time in comfort and ease? There are so many simple yet useful tricks that can turn your mundane commute into a pleasant journey. And here are 15 of the best. Before we get this show on the road, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button. While you're at it, give the notification bell a ring so that you don't miss any of the daily updates on the bright side of life. 13. A pin on the map will help you find your parked car. Ah, I forgot where I parked my car! Ever uttered these words to yourself? Of course you have, haven't we all? It can be especially difficult to find your car when it's in a huge parking lot or you've parked in a multi-level garage. It's even tougher at night. And yeah, we all forget to check the row or level we parked on. Well, it's no longer a problem if you use this handy little trick. Simply drop a pin with the location of your car on your mobile map. In this case, Google Maps will eagerly help you locate your vehicle in no time. 12. Use a cereal container as a trash can. You probably know how inconvenient it can be to have to constantly stop and throw away some trash out of your car. Or, if you don't make these stops, garbage just keeps piling up all over the inside of your vehicle. Fortunately, you don't have to choose between these two options. Take an empty cereal container, put a trash bag inside, and voila! You now have an ideal no-spill trash can for all your empty wrappers and cups. Plus, you don't have to worry about it spilling if you turn or brake too abruptly. 11. A roll of duct tape as a cup holder. Your car is most likely equipped with a perfectly useful cup holder, but what if you have one beverage too many? Instead of squeezing it between your thighs and risking a really embarrassing accident, you can put a roll of duct tape on the passenger seat to place your drink inside. Plus, you'll always have the universally handy duct tape within reach wherever you need it. 10. A tackle box makes a great snack kit. What could be better than having your own personal snack supply on the road? If you like variety but can't stand taking a bunch of different packages that you have to pull over just to open safely, then here's your perfect solution. Take a tackle box, raid a grocery store or your kitchen, and assemble a nice little kit of your favorite snacks. No fuss, no mess, and no more stopping at convenience stores just to ease your cravings. To get you started on your snack pack, here are some suggestions of what to fill it with. Pretzels, chopped nuts, cheesy popcorn, M&Ms, crackers, dried fruit or berries, granola, raisins, potato chips, cookies. Mmm. I think I'll get started on making mine right about now. Oh, wait, we still have lots more car hacks and tips to go. 9. Don't forget about a two-port USB charger. Deciding who gets to charge their phone or tablet on the road usually turns into a battle of who's on a lower percentage or who has a more important call or text they're waiting for. Whew. Skip the drama and make use of a two-port USB car charger. And if you can't go anywhere without your multiple gadgets and gizmos, opt for a multi-port USB charger. It's also handy when you're traveling with a big group of friends. 8. Keep an emergency kit in your car. It's always a good idea to keep emergency essentials in your car, especially if you're going on a long road trip. This way, you won't end up stranded on the side of the road without any supplies. The most important thing your emergency kit should have inside include a flashlight and some spare batteries, road flares, jumper cables, a tool kit, a first aid kit with band-aids, antiseptic, antibiotic ointment, bug spray, 
tweezers, cotton balls, gauze pads, bandage wrap, and aspirin. Your vehicle's owner's manual in case you have to repair your car on your own. A fire extinguisher. They make small ones that are easy to store. Rain ponchos that will protect you in bad weather. A reflective safety vest. A warm blanket. Comfortable shoes or sneakers. A roll of toilet paper. Laugh now, but the day might come when you'll be happy you followed this tip. A gallon or two of water. Pack a fresh one for long road trips. Some extra stuff you may want to keep in your car includes an ice scraper, hat litter, it's irreplaceable when you get stuck in the mud, and a small battery-powered fan. Now you're all ready for anything that might come your way. 7. A shoe organizer as a holder. If you're sick and tired of the chaos that's invaded your car, just use a shoe organizer to make your space neat and tidy. Hang it on the back of the driver or passenger seat and stock it up with all the items you need on a trip. It'll allow you easy access to maps, music, books, kids' toys, and snacks. 6. Don't forget your inflatable mattress. For especially long road trips, or maybe a situation when you're way too tired to be behind the wheel, you might decide to get some sleep in your car. Whatever it might be, keep a blow-up mattress in your trunk just in case. Simply put it in the back seat, inflate it, and there you go! They even make special inflatable mattresses that fit cars perfectly. 5. Take an atlas. You know what the downside of being dependent on electronics is? They don't always work. What will you do if your GPS or phone suddenly dies and you don't have a charger with you? That's why you should always keep a road atlas in your car. It'll come in handy when everything else is of no use. 4. A rubber band as a phone holder If you haven't gotten a phone holder yet, you can use a rubber band or a hair tie. Just loop it through a vent in your car's heating and air conditioning system and use it to hold your phone in place. This way, you'll always be able to see the screen when following directions. 3. Go to a fast food restaurant if you get lost. Let's say you got lost, your phone's dead, and you forgot to take your roadmap, or you're trying to find a certain place in an unfamiliar town. Well, you can always go old school and ask for directions. And there's no better place to ask than a fast food restaurant or a gas station. These two places see so many drivers all day every day, a lot of whom probably ask for directions, so the staff will most likely have the answer to your question as well. 2. Floor mats will help you if you get stuck Tons of people have probably heard of the kitty litter technique for when you get stuck in the mud or snow. But not all of us think to keep cat litter in our car for this purpose. So, in that case, you can also use your floor mats. Just place them under the back wheels to increase traction. This method works just as well when it comes to getting your car unstuck. 1. Breathe fresh air with the help of a button. There's a special button on the dashboard of your car that takes care of the air you breathe. It's called the car's recirculation button. Surprisingly, not a lot of people know exactly what this little image means, even though they do switch it on from time to time. If you're stopped in traffic, you can push this button to keep the dirty and polluted air around your car from getting inside. It'll recirculate the cleanish air that's already in your car. Which of these road hacks have you ever used? Do you know any other tricks that can make your drive more pleasant? Let us know down in the comments! If you're going to use at least one of these tips, then remember to give the video a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Remember to subscribe to our channel, where life is much more fun on the Bright Side!